this is in Ikone city, and the city block is decided by the direction of Lake Biwa. This building is two artists as living as a family with the children. This geometry is uh, depending on the direction of the site. The grid, city grid is not facing south and north. So if we cut the building like 45 degree, the residence facade, the red facing south, and the artery facade facing north, that direction. So that's our intention to use this geometry. Originally, this is a very simple house-like shape, but if we cut this volume with this diagonal line, you could make the best use of the sun energy facing south and north. That's the, our strategy. We've adapted the, this 45 degree angle geometry to the direction of the site. So this is residential park here, facing south. And from this corridor there, you can head, head to the, you can go to the atelier part. It's open wide to north. So they're doing the painting school here. And in this part, husband and wife is always working together. She is working as a jewelry designer. Yeah, so it's kind of gallery. This is the space for the living room we call. Uh -huh. This is the uh, no, bedroom. Oh, yeah. great. Mm. The ceiling, you can see the structure, wooden structure. And we are hiding the structure inside the wall because we use this wall to exhibit their works. So they use here as a gallery sometimes. Okay. There is a kitchen there. Mm -hmm. And because they don't want to have the very normal kitchen mm -hmm. inside the gallery, we just uh, made this a very thin wooden plate, put it onto the wall, and mm -hmm. they just made a hole for this uh, fire and water. The end of the kitchen, there is the children's space there. Ah. So between these residential part and the part, there is the connection corridor. And this skylight gives us the natural light to the <laughs> core bathroom space. Mm. You could see the natural light from the ceiling. Neighbors of the small natural light to the toilets. <laughs> Very minimum house, but it has everything. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, this is, used to be a dining space here. Do you work here or eat or? Please <laughs> We designed the maximum volume within the budget, so that's a their request. The normal two by six or two by four structure is not afford to make a disc big window, but if we design the three dimensional structure, afford to have this kind of museum like big window. The residential part to the atrium part is getting higher, and ceiling height close to six meter. Residential part, um, three point five two meters. Stand atrium part, uh, almost six meter. That's the uh, kind of beyond the house scale. And also this special geometrical shape shows 
the, this suburban area, the uh, building shape itself, the northeast border to the city. Because you wanted people to notice the house. Yes, that's the client's request. They sometimes use this as a gallery and uh, also for art classes. So the, the building itself becomes the kind of advertisement. At uh, this uh, atelier's big window facing just exactly north, and uh, this kind of soft light as a very stable light from the north is important for the artery works. <laughs> Do you work in here? She is using this table ah. when she does her own work. Does she have any work? Yeah. So, 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 We uh, eventually find this kind of very low height ceiling, but that's still uh, very interesting, very attractive. <laughs> if you go beneath this big structure to the human structure, human scale, you could feel very intimate distance to the outside environment. You cannot directly see the uh, suburban car streets. But you could feel the, this kind of, even though these wheels, you could feel the night nature's natural context here. And another same, uh, same geometry you could find the, to the north side hall there. So that's the sky hall itself. With the, this, you could see the sky there. That's the sky. Okay, that okay. makes that, that tunnel is the sky hall. Ne? Mm. Uh, this, these two volume is a hole, scope-like shape. You could have the space with the window, that's the normal room shape. But uh, this hole uh, has the direction and uh, the, uh, you have the relation with the uh, uh, two windows. The architecture becomes the window, is the, our first intention. It's not just light that comes in one side of it, it flows through. Of course. The outside material is the galvanized sheet that has the minimum waves, meaning the most minimum materials. We get rid of the rain gutters. We solved the problem of the snow. And also you can see the clear edge of the buildings without the rain gutters. Using this uh, three-dimensionally uh, geometrical form reflects the cloudy skylight. The metallic facade shows the edge of the forms. So the building itself becomes the kind of advertisement board in a car street. She always fixing everything. <laughs> and after she used, she, uh, no, how can I say? 
Put it away. We'll put it away. Ah. And, uh, she said, that's the, that's the secret. <laughs> Don't leave it, everything. <laughs> And food? A very supermarket store near, so she says she doesn't stock many things. She goes shopping every day. There is child room there. So there is his room. His personal belongings are inside. <laughs> Between these sky holes, there is the connection corridor. With this narrow space, you could change your feeling going past this middle corridor, which is uh, very important to make a mixed use of residential part and artery part. Do you spend a lot of time here with, the, with your son? Or where do you, do you spend most of your time for living? <laughs> They're spending whole evening, yeah, here. And his son brings his toy from his uh, room to here and play here. Is it enough space for living? <laughs> Mm. Ah, so At this moment, for the free member, she says she, it's enough. Mm. But when, his, um, when her son grown up yeah. and, uh, to make his friend come to his house, <laughs> it can be a bit uh, narrow. But until then, she said it's okay with this mm -hmm. yeah. for, for, for them. Mm. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.